What is going on guys? It is your boy T here man. We are back with a brand new reaction video. We're gonna be reacting to some more EuroLeague players now. We're not gonna be reacting to just any EuroLeague player, okay? We're reacting to what they call the best or number one Euro player, EuroLeague player in the league right now. His name is Nando De Colo De Coyo. I don't know how you say it, I'm just I'm just going with it, but if you can read by the title, then you know who I'm talking about. Now, there's a lot of hype around this guy. Now, I don't know why. I don't really know what position he plays. Uh, okay, so he plays. He's a point guard slash shooting guard. Now, with that being said, I'm expecting a lot of crossovers. I'm expecting a lot of good assists. You know, some facilitating going on. Um, some three-pointers, some middies. I'm just expecting a lot from him because he's a point guard shooting guard. So, at that position, there's a lot required of you. Especially if people are calling you the best or number one in the Euro League right now. So I'm excited for this video, man. I'm excited to see what he has to bring, what he has to offer to the team, and just his gameplay in general, man. So I hope you guys are excited for this video, man. Let's get into it. <clears throat> okay, let's get it. That's him. That's him. Number one. Okay, number one, number one. I feel it. I feel it. Shout out to my basketball TV. Link to the channel will be in the description. As always. I don't like the yearly balls, man. Good take. I don't like the two-tone, the two-color balls. I'm not a fan of it. Oh, pull up. Okay. Oh, work him, work him off that screen. See, there's a seat right there, boom. You see that pass? You see that pass? See, there's a difference between like a good point guard and an average point guard. Average point guard came off that and like passed it straight to him. I saw that he came off and he threw it like a bit this way to pull him away from the defender so he could catch like you know in like a bit more open space than what it feels like right there boom caught it right there gave him an easy shot I saw that that was nice that was a good pass see you gotta you gotta notice that shit man like it legit separates like the good point guards shooting guards from like just average ones damn this dude's low-key nice hold on Now for all my EuroLeague fans out there, for all my EuroLeague supporters, I, I've already watched Luca play, I watched one of his videos, because I think they played the same position, who do you think is better? Who do you guys think is better, Luca or, oh what's his name, I forgot his name already, Nando, Nando, that's an ugly as fuck jump shot, but it goes in so fuck it, who cares, but who do you guys think better, Luca or Nando? Shit, he's a, he's, I like him. I like I like this dude a lot. I like this dude a lot. Come off that. Boom. See how he just attacks the person instead of just attacking the open space. Pull up, money ball. Damn, this dude's cold. Pull up. Mm, money ball, easy. Don't leave me open. Don't leave. Don't leave me open. If you leave me open, you're gonna pay. Oh, that's deep. Mmm. That, that's too much space for me, baby. That's too much space. I would like to see. Oh my god. Now nah, we're going back. 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 We're going back to that one. Holy shit. We gotta go back. Buck his knee buckled. God damn. I would love to see him and Luca go one on one against each other. I know Luca has like more size, but Nando, he's he's real um what's the word? Um crafty with the ball and real like good at creating space. Good pass, that's money, that's all there, that's easy. Oh, oh, he jumped, he fell for it. Rookie. God damn. Spin. Yeah. Ali Yoop. Okay. I thought he missed that. See, he. That's. I love this dude, man. He doesn't hesitate to pull it. Like, he has that little space, a little space to shoot. He's going to pull it. He's that confident in himself. Good move behind the back. Oh, attack. Keep going. Keep going. All the way. If they ain't gonna stop you, keep, just keep going. If they, if they don't pick you up, just keep going to the hoop. Pull up. No hesitation. 
See, point guards like Kemba. Oh, shh. He faked me with that pass. See, point guards like Kemba are so hard to mark. Like, you don't know whether he's like a pass first point guard, a score first, because he legit does everything. Like, if he's open, he'll shoot that. If he's not, like, he'll still find a way. Like, oh, man. This dude, I, he would be hard to mark. He would be hard to guard. Come off, roll. Are you pulling that? Jesus. Why he low key remind me of like a Steph Curry of the Euro League? Would that be fair to say, or am I reaching with that one? Let me know. Now, would that be? Now would that be fair to me, would that be fair of me to say or to compare him to being like the Steph Curry of the Euro League? Cause like legit pull up a Steph Curry highlight and pull up a Nando 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 highlight, put them next to each other and just like just let them play. Like they the similarities in the way they play, like they come off screens, pull up, you know, dribbling, attack, you know. They're so like the little things that they do are so close. <laughs> Excuse me, the little things that they do are just so similar. And it's why, like, when I was watching him, like, towards the end, I was like, this dude, Loki, reminds me of Steph. But, man, what do you guys think? Do you guys think he is the best? Because that's what they said. Um, and they said Luka was, like, fifth best in the EuroLeague right now. Fifth or sixth best in the EuroLeague. So, I don't know, man. I would love to see these two, him and Luka, go up against each other one-on-one. -on -one, um, like, in, like, a practice. Or, like, even, like, in a game. Is there, like, a game highlight of these two battling against each other? Because I would love to see that, man. Nando and... Luca go up against one on one. That would be an intense matchup. Practice the game doesn't really matter. I would just love to see them battle it out because I feel like they would both drop buckets on each other because they're both crafty in their own unique ways. Luca is like more like powerful, like bigger body, like you know he like forces way to the hoop, but he also has like a crossing pullback. Nando is quick as shit. He's got like a quick handle. You know he's real crafty, real slick, real smooth with it. So putting those two against each other would be an insane game to watch. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, man. If you guys did, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button down below. It really does mean a lot to me. If you want to see me react to any other kind of video, make sure you leave it down in the comment section below, and I will get around checking to the majority of most of them when I can. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll see you guys all in the next one.